you make manifest the beginnings of our redemption through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift from your heart. We lift your heart to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly really right and just our duty and our salvation. Always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For in the mystery of the world made flesh, a new light of your glory has shone upon the eyes of our mind. So that as we recognize in him God made visible, you may be caught up through him in love of things invisible. And so, with angels and archangels, with thrones and dominions, and with all the hosts and powers of heaven, we sing the hymn of your glory as without end we are there. <laughs>
unto the sorrowful of heart joy, to accomplish your plan, he gave himself up to death. And rising from the dead, he destroyed death and restored life. And that we might live no longer for ourselves, but for him who died and rose again for us. He sent the Holy Spirit from you, Father, as the first fruits of those who believe, so that bringing to perfection his work in the world, he might sanctify creation to the full. Therefore, O Lord, we humbly pray that this same Holy Spirit graciously sanctify these offerings, that they may become the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. For the celebration of this great mystery, which he himself left us as an eternal covenant. For when the hour had come for him to be glorified by you, Father, most truly, having called his own who we are in the world, he loved them to the end. And when they were at supper, he took bread, blessed and broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body. Which will be given up for you. In a similar way, taking the chalice filled with the fruit of the vine, he gave thanks, and gave the chalice to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in the morning.
and with your four souls and saints in your kingdom. There, with the whole of creation freed from the corruption of sin and death, will we glorify you through Christ our Lord, to whom to this God of the world all that is good. Through him and with him and in him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. Amen. At the Savior's commandment, for by divine teaching, we dare to sing. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Amen. 